Hello boys and girls, welcome to check out uh, another att attempt of mine, uh, well, attempted recording of Planescape. Why not? Why not indeed. Uh, this is um, this is the second time I'm sort of trying to uh, trying to get the recording right. And, uh, I actually did manage to uh, to record one session, but uh, some of the settings weren't uh, quite aligned, and uh, and uh, as a result, uh, the characters. Uh, well, in the, in the final video, the characters uh, flicker on the screen. So I'm gonna I'm gonna upload that one too, but keep it hidden so that only the hardcore fans. That means like maybe two people out of ten who actually watch my stuff uh, will uh, will find it if they want to. Anyway, uh, since. Uh, gonna repeat some of the stuff that uh, uh, that I was pitching about in the first video. Time is precious. Let us not squander it here. Yes, yes. But here is good. Done. So the first uh, first recording goes back a little bit more chronologically uh, to the point uh, where we picked up Nordum. Right now we are behind uh, the door of the evil wizard. But before we go, what a on, curious construct this is! Indeed. But uh, bef before we uh, we enter the wizard's lair, uh, let's see. I think we can rest here. Oh no, no, we can't. Okay. In this case, it's. Uh, been a while since I actually played this part, so I can't quite remember what stuff we do have and what we don't have, and and all that. sorts of stuff. Apparently... Yeah, so... Uh, while we were... Uh, while we were... Uh, uh, exploring the maze, I kept picking up all those... Uh, oculars. And... Uh, and now I... I gave them to Norm. Some preparations in order. Endure. In enduring, grow strong. That can between the sessions uh, I'm sort of uh, uh, sort of uh, I not must confess that Nordum is perhaps the cutest little rogue modron I've ever encountered rogue modron thank you very much uh, I'm, I'm not overly uh, used with this uh, used to these controls and, uh, and since I don't practice very often uh, I sometimes I sort of uh, feel quite butterfingers about this. Also, later on, I'm gonna I'm gonna complain, well, comment on the controls. 
struggles in general. Evil! first uh, entered the maze I sort of uh, assumed that Modron no Nordum Nordum would be the evil wizard everybody keeps talking about so when during my last session I sort of stumbled upon this room I was quite surprised
mouse cursor trail will show up in the recording. It's uh, something. Uh, uh, it's a side effect of uh, my turning off the uh, turning off the uh, video driver. More more on that uh, later.
some some of this stuff will be in the uh, first recording as well. But, uh, basically. This is one reason why I'm here. I mean, in the cube, uh, in in this fortress, is to uh, is to gain some experience and get some levels before getting on with the uh, uh, with the end game. She has so much more room. One thing that's uh, kind of difficult for me to get used to. you have the spell in your book then you know it it's, it's not like uh, uh, it's um, I don't know no no none of that memorizing stuff sort of uh, memorize stuff and, uh, and then use it and it's gone for a period of time that's a little bit alien to me
All right. I estimate fall from grace to be found attractive by the male sex <laughs> of over 321,423 separate species. Give or take five. <laughs> oh. Does that include Modrons? I am no longer able to answer that question. <laughs> I do not know. logic where you can uh, where you can pause and uh, then choose actions and then only then execute what was that I realized this is actually sort of similar to how the vats uh, aiming system works in uh, the new era full fallout limbo location Rubicon testing grounds testing grounds. Goody. Okay, that's a good thing. And then there. That's not real money, is it? Nope. Done. say suffers but uh, mm, there is a noticeable effect uh, well my perception is affected by the fact that uh, that uh, these uh, interface elements were uh, sort of uh, fully developed or reached their optimal development then in uh, later games than this one 
forgot what's the... Uh, I'm gone. Done. No, thank you. I forgot what's the uh, sort of code name for this... Uh, for this occurrence. Uh, we're running in circles, aren't we? Aha, uh -huh, okay, so this is... Mortem's lair. Many of are safe here. The wizard wasn't far from here. And we can save, uh, I mean, uh, rest here. Like right here? Nope. Okay, let's go back. I think it was just a few cubes away from from Nodrum's lair. So. Hey, why don't you hop back to Mechanus, Nord of Mechanus? Wait, what, what, what? <laughs> I do not accept orders from you. oil. This is <laughs> Oh, I found the room where I haven't been. Greeting. I'm gonna use this. 
I think, therefore I am. I think. Claim that's a modest name. Time is... See that? Dead horse. <laughs> Just seeing you crawl back to. Okay. Loot. Uh... Yeah, it's all fun and games when I just try to. Uh, when I try to. I, I I feel like I'm in a cuckoo clock, a cuckoo cuckoo clock. I don't think I saved after the last uh, last encounter, which sucks. But yeah, it's it's all fun and games when I just sort of explore the area without uh, trying to get anywhere. But uh, when I actually try to get somewhere specific. Oh, but uh, I also wanted 
you say how we ended up in the in the cube uh, thing is that uh, at first I I got to the uh, end of the game and uh, I I had pretty much used up all the uh, exotic items from uh, Vrishka's uh, shop except the cube and uh, in some I don't know uh, I had asked around about it I think it was the gallery lady who uh, suggested that suggested that it might be a portal of some sort but uh, uh, somehow I, I just forgot about it and I successfully tinkered uh, the uh, portal sequence when we were already in, in the fortress and also why, why I started to tinker around was that I noticed uh, that my map had these empty patches so uh, once we are done here then I'm also gonna uh, piss off the lady and uh, and do the player's maze but now back here done but still there are more well this actually uh, as, it, it feels a little bit like a chore I must admit but also uh, it serves the purpose of uh, Getting, uh, gaining perhaps a few more levels before uh, we finally get to the fortress. Okay, there are three of them here. to address your body. <laughs> Pardon me? Your body, your form, your reason for selecting it. Oh. Why? Why? Hmm. I suppose I find it comforting. Besides, I rather like the wings. I thought he was addressing her boobs. It would be more practical for you to assume the form of a Modron. <laughs> it is 13.27% more efficient. Give or take 5.2%. <laughs> Why no, Devil? Are you trying to court me? It was not my intention to initiate legal action against you. <laughs> oh. part of the maze where I haven't been before. How many to... Well, let's try brute force. Gone. Okay, let's sort some stuff out. 
one thing that I found very, very unintuitive at first uh, in, the, in these types of games. Uh, I'm not speaking specifically of Planescape, but uh, sort of this uh, learning by observation, watching others play uh, similar stuff. Uh, it was that, uh, that you can uh, just sort of open the inventory screen and uh, and drop items between your uh, party members, however you please now. Okay, just one. And at first it seemed, uh, I don't know, highly unnatural. But again, uh, there was this one... All right. One moment that uh, changed all. Let's see if I can reenact it. So it turns out that if the party is not uh, bunched together, you can't swap stuff. And this one little line uh, kind of uh, took away all the uh, all the uh, sense of alienation. I'm gone. So Done. It's, uh, Quite usual that when I uh, when I whine about something uh, in a game, then it's not so much the mechanic that I I might have problem with, but how it's presented. And uh, in this case, uh, one one little uh, well, it's not an error message, but obstacle message uh, sort of remedied the whole situation. Okay, but before we go into the maze, it seems like, uh, I mean, go further into the maze, and it seems like it might take a while. I'm gonna pause here, and, uh, and try to try to negotiate with my screen capture program. So, bye-bye for now, and see you soon.